My name is Claire Foxton and I'm a mural artist and graphic designer. When I was a small child, my first memory of you know, art or being creative is sort of wrapped up in my nana and going to my nana's house. During school holidays and things like that, we used to go there and she would mind us and, and I'd basically spend all day just colouring in. She would colour in too with me and we'd do it together. So it was a really nice, I guess, memory that I have. The public art came about from one opportunity where there was a wall and they needed someone to paint it and I said yes and I, it sort of all came flooding back, all of the, the, the love that I have for painting. It can feel like a very heart opening and vulnerable experience as well so there's fear in that as well because you're, you're essentially opening yourself. It's like performance art. It's very public and it's open to criticism all the time have really helped me grow as a person too and I wasn't expecting that is the connections and the people that I've met have completely floored me. That's, that's one of the biggest, most unexpected things that I've come to realise with um, my work. So yeah, it's, it's definitely an emotional roller coaster, um, and there's always a period right before I start painting where I'm absolutely like almost in the fetal position rocking back and forth going I can't do this, I can't do this, it just seems too big. So, so the feeling of elation at the end is always, uh, it, that's what keeps me going. <laughs> I have a, a lot of projects that I have held very close to my heart. One of the most recent projects I did in Liverpool in Sydney. She was an amazing inspiration to me and I wasn't really expecting that when we, when we first started chatting. But it was, a, it was also a mammoth job in terms of the scale. I was um, basically running, running the show and it was an eight storey building. I was stepping away from just being the artist and I was doing a lot of other roles. But that was a particularly beautiful project because it was sort of full circle. I was involved in every part of the process, in choosing the subject, in, in meeting her and, and, and chatting to her about her story. My concept is very much about exploring the everyday person and people who, I guess, help to build a community. It's starting to feel three years on that I've actually found who I am as a person, but also my art style as well, yeah. I've, I've always been one to follow my heart and if something feels right, I'll do it. And I say yes to almost everything, which is probably bad, but it has led me in some of the most interesting, on some very interesting paths and has definitely contributed to who I am today, which I'm proud to be, so yeah.